Assalamualaikum everyone With me Cikgu Azrini Today we are going to learn Unit 3 Humans Okay actually There are few subtopics In Unit 3 But for today we are focusing on Human teeth Okay for human teeth We are going to learn Okay number 1 Types of teeth and their functions Number 2 Structure of a tooth Number 3 Milk teeth and permanent teeth. And number four, dental care. But for dental care, we will uh, learn in another lesson. So, let's start. Part one, types of teeth and their functions. Look at your sign textbook, page 30. Types of teeth and their functions. We have three types of teeth. Let us find out about these teeth and their functions. Okay, we have canines, molars, and incisors. Let us look one by one. The first type to discuss is the incisor, which is the name. There are basically eight incisors. Four in the upper jaw, one, two, three, four, and four in the lower jaw, one, two, three, four. So there are eight incisors. This teeth are used to cut food. your teeth and you are eating using it have you ever wondered how does it look inside your tooth so let's see okay let's look at page 32 in your science textbook structure of a tooth Aisha is observing her teeth in a mirror E, my teeth are hard. I wonder what is inside them. If we take a cross section of a tooth, what can we observe? Let us look at the structure of a tooth below. 
Okay, so this is a simple cross section of a tool. We have to recognize each part. Okay, the white part is called animal. Below the animal, we have dentine. Then we have gum ataupun gusi. The yellow color is called nerve. While the red and blue color are called blood vessels. Part 3. Milk teeth and permanent teeth. So we will be looking at your science textbook page 34 and 35. Let us observe the situation below. Father, my tooth came out. Oh, it's okay. It's just a milk tooth. A permanent tooth will grow in its place. What is a milk tooth and a permanent tooth, father? Let me tell you about it. Humans have two sets of teeth. They are the milk teeth and the permanent teeth. So from this conversation, we know that humans have two types of teeth. The first one is milk teeth and another one is permanent teeth okay so we're gonna look through this milk teeth set and permanent teeth set okay for milk teeth set there are 20 teeth which are 8 incisors, 4 canines, and 8 molars. For permanent teeth set, there are 32 teeth, which are 8 incisors, 4 canines, and 20 molars. But the similarities for both set, they have the same types of teeth which are incisors, canines, and molars. But they are different in number. Okay, milk teeth, milk teeth sets, there are 20 teeth. While permanent teeth sets, there are 32 teeth. Okay, for milk teeth sets, thin layers of enamel and dentine. While for permanent teeth sets, they have thick layers of enamel and dentine. Okay, gigi susu lapisan yang nipis, gigi kekal lapisan yang tebal. Milk teeth sets teeth are smaller and not strong. For permanent teeth sets, teeth are bigger and stronger. For milk teeth sets, teeth are not permanent and have a short life span. Okay, short life span means we won't be using this, this teeth for a long time. Okay, for permanent teeth set, teeth are permanent and have a long life span. Means that we will have these teeth until we are old. Okay, milk teeth set start to grow at 6 months old and are complete at 3 years old. While permanent teeth set um, they start to grow at 6 years old and are complete at 21 years old. Ok, 
Okay, so that's all for milk teeth sets and permanent teeth sets. The similarities only uh, they have uh, same types of teeth which are incisors, canines and molars. While the others are all different. Okay, persamaannya cuma kedua-dua set gigi ini mempunyai jenis gigi yang sama iaitu incisors, canines and molars. Okay, manakala yang lain semuanya berbeza. Okay, bilangan yang berbeza, kekuatan berbeza, saiz juga berbeza dan jangka hayat pun berbeza. Okay, so now we are going to complete uh, your science activity book page 17 until 21. Okay, for page uh, 17, okay, you need three humans, look at my teeth. Okay, you need to write the date here. Okay, the instruction, color the teeth using the clues given. Name the types of teeth. Okay, first of all, you need to color. Okay, number one, okay, clue, blue. So, you need to color number one with blue color. All number one, you need to color with blue color. And then, number two, yellow color. And number three, green color. After that, you need to name the types of teeth here. You need to write your answer here. Okay, so let's check. Okay, number one, blue in color is incisor. Okay, number two, you can see the pointed teeth. Okay, tajam kan? So, ini ialah gigi taring. So, number two, the answer is canine. And then number three, the widest and flattest one in the mouth. Yang paling besar. The answer is molar. Okay, now, page 18, the functions of my teeth. Match each tooth with its function. Okay, function of tooth. Cuts food, grinds food, tears food. Okay, you need to match with the correct answer. And then, page 19, knowing the functions of teeth, Tick the types of teeth that indicate their correct functions. Okay, number one, number two and number three. You look at the pictures and tick the correct answers. Okay, and then page 20. Cross section of a tooth. Complete the sketch of the tooth structure and label it. Then, color the parts. Okay, for this one, you can refer your textbook page 32. Okay, you can refer here. You need to complete the sketch of the tooth structure. Lengkapkan lakaran ini. Labelkan dan warnakan. And then the last one, page 21. Human teeth. Complete the following table. Okay. Milk teeth sets and permanent teeth set. So you need to write the similarities here. And then the differences. Okay, for this, you can refer in your sign textbook, page 35. All the answers are here. Okay, I will give you example. Similarities have the same type of teeth which are incisors, 
canines and molars. Then uh, the differences. Okay, number of teeth for milk teeth sets 20 teeth. For permanent teeth set 32 teeth. So I hope you can complete this exercise. So that's all for today. In our next lesson, we will learn dental care. So thank you and happy learning.